Hello, I'm Jerry Fort, the Beer Review Guy. We've got Jeremy Fort, my son, and he is going to help me do a energy drink review. This is the Monster, or this is Monster Juice, I guess. Mango Loco, huh? Mango Loco? Monster Juice. Energy juice. <laughs> and you say you haven't seen this one around before? Mm -mm. But we don't know if it's new. We just haven't seen it in our area. Um, but we got some some skeletons um, dressed up like um, Spanish señoritas, I guess. Is that? <clears throat> Um, let's see, it says something here. On the eve of October 31st, each year, each year, friends and family gather to celebrate Dia. Dia de los Muer Muertos. Muertos, yeah. Marigolds, myst mysticism, and memories combined with food and drink entice the souls of the departed to join the party. Mango Loco is a heavenly blend of exotic juices certain to extract, certain to attract even the most stubborn spirit. Crazy good taste with just enough of that monster magic to keep the party going for days. Unleash the beast. <clears throat> Vitamins plus taurine, l carnitine l carnitine plus b vitamins okay all right ingredients carbonated water sugar guava puree white grape juice concentrate mango puree glucose glucose um, apple juice concentrate citric acid pineapple syrup pineapple juice concentrate Lemon pulp, apricot puree, orange juice concentrate, peach puree. Man, all kinds of flavors in this thing. Mm -hmm. Passion fruit juice, gum arabic. Uh, that's about it. My goodness. This is a 16 fluid ounce can. All right. Well, let's... Uh, Let's check this thing out. The energy drinks are Jeremy's thing. Um, so I just have a sample of it and I let Jeremy have the more amount of it. <clears throat> and this looks like, sorry, did I get your foot? This looks like it's going to be blue, doesn't it? To make this because of the can? It's probably going to be orange. You think it's going to be orange? Let's see. Color. Uh, well, he may be right. Let's see who's right. Well, Jeremy's closer. Yeah. It kind of looks like pineapple juice, doesn't it? Yeah, a little bit. A little bit. <clears throat> I don't know. If it says puree in there, so let's see. Just let me swirl it about just a little bit, just in case. Wow. Really cloudy, isn't it? Yep. Throw that up there. Okay, so I mean, yours is deep orange. Mm -hmm. You must have got the bottom, the bottom of the can. Cause I got a lighter orange than Jeremy's, mm -hmm. and it's very hazy. Even mine's hazy, but Jeremy's is really murky. Ooh. Man, there's a there's a bitterness in there, isn't there? Smell yeah, that. Bit. That's kind of smells grapefruity. Yeah. You smell that grapefruit in there? Mm -hmm. <clears throat> little pineapple. Mm -hmm. Mango. A little sweet mango. Um, that grapefruit is pretty prominent in there. Yeah. Smells really good. Yeah. 
Let's try it out. <clears throat> wow, that's very flavorful. Flavorful. Mm -hmm. A little sourness on the uh, on the finish there. Mine is a <clears throat> a medium body. Yours looks like it'd be more full. You getting a kind of a full body on that on yours? Because you got a lot. Of, it looks like you got a lot of the puree from the bottom of the can or something. Mm -hmm. I got the what wasn't settled in the first pour. Yeah, I'm getting the pineapple. I'm getting mm -hmm. the grapefruit very lightly on the on the taste. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> taste the mango. Um, I can probably pick out go. most of the fruits that said the ingredients, like Pe peach and. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> oh yeah, there was the white peach in there. Juice and stuff like that. Just a very good mixture. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, very, very good. Mm -hmm. They're just making the. It seems like they're making the energy drinks better. You know, they're just making them more so that there's more flavor and they don't taste just like a like a vitamin bomb or something. You know what I mean? Yeah. Oh my nose. Very good. Mm -hmm. But uh, yeah, check this thing out. If you like energy drinks, we're not big drinkers of these things. We um, just occasionally we'll we'll uh, we'll have one. Um, even Jeremy, he doesn't drink these that much anymore since he started reviewing them with me. Um, but just occasionally we'll, we'll enjoy one. And um, so there you go. Try this one out if you've already tried it. Let us know in a comment if you liked it or not. Um, and we've already reviewed some energy drinks that we've tried. Uh, we're eventually going to keep trying more and more. Um, feel free to let us know. You know, give us something to look for and something you want to see us do on the energy drinks or any other drinks. But this is a variety channel. If you're new to my channel, um, this is a variety one. I do all kinds of stuff. Um, even though my channel name is The Beer Review Guy, I, I do all kinds of stuff. So I hope you enjoy that. I hope it's something that you, you will uh, find entertaining and interesting. But, uh, <clears throat> but real quick, before, uh, before we go, I got some new subscribers. Um, Tim Laxton, Till Beer Do Us Part. Grind Time, which is Cree Cree. He changed his channel name to uh, to Grind Time. Uh, Juan Git, Git, Gut, Gutierrez, Gutierrez, Gutierrez. G sorry, apologize if you if you're watching this. Um, Michael Holsinger, uh, Shuey's Gaming Paradise, um, Lane Cruikshank, uh, Twick. Uh, Vortex Awakens, Caleb Gray, Daniel Brower, Chinsey Fob, Ian Ashcraft, Dance, Dance Temp, Neu, Neu, sorry about that if I mispronounced it, The Southern Railfan, Log Cabin Gaming, Mr. Riaz25, Skakes or Skax, Skakes, 1982, and Brendan Adams and Wintroll, and the other ones that I received recently, I'll acknowledge you on the. Uh, I'll, I'll keep acknowledging some um, on other reviews, but those are my most recent ones, or my earliest ones, I guess you say. But anyway, thank you all for subscribing. I appreciate it, and we'll end it there. Is there anything more you want to say about this, Jeremy? I don't think so really good yeah man very drinkable mm -hmm. Whew. smooth thanks for watching we appreciate it we'll see you on the next one